Hi guys! This is Kat Nierman and welcome back to my channel. Today, gagamit si Mami Kat Nier ng mga budget-friendly makeup products. Some of the products that I will use have been in my makeup collection for quite a while already, but some are new na binili ko sa Watson. So, lahat ng mga products na gagamitin ko um, are locally available and um, specifically, I bought them all at Watson. Okay, so here we go! Before anything else, we have to apply sunblock on our face before putting on makeup. And since this is a budget-friendly makeup tutorial, naghanap ako sa Watsons ng affordable na sunscreen. Um, I found the Quick Effects sunblock. Ganito ang itsura niya. Ayan. And it provides SPF 50 PA++++. The benefits are ultralight, fast-absorbing sunblock with broad spe spectrum, UVA and UVB protection um, helps protect against the damaging effects of the sun. Okay, this has niacinamide, zinc oxide, lotus flower, BSASM, herb and herb, herb extracts. Okay, hindi na makapagsalita si Mami Kat niyo. <laughs> so, subukan na natin to. This is the first time I'm gonna use it and I hope that I won't break out. Pero if this is gonna work, talagang magandang product to kasi very cheap lang. It only costs 99 pesos. So, ganito ang itsura niya when you squeeze it out. Yan. Wala yung white siya. Sticky siya at first, pero pag na-absorb na ng skin niyo, hindi na. Okay. Maglagay din tayo sa neck kasi importante din maglagay ng sunscreen sa neck. Okay, next, gagamit tayo na the EB Advanced BB Cream. Ayan siya. This costs 220 pesos. It is the white, whitening BB Cream from EB Advanced. Na swatch, na swatch ko na to. Medyo maputi siya for my liking. Pero, you know, sanay naman na tayo na maputi ang mga BB Cream. And ito siya pag swinach sa hands. Kuha na, nasa tube siya. So, kuha lang tayo ng konting-konti lang. Kasi, baka mamaya eh, kung madamihan natin, magmukha tayong multo sa pake. <laughs> Since BB cream to, kamay ko na gagamitin ko ha. Medyo maputi nga siya talaga for my skin tone. Pero okay siya kasi yellow yung undertone niya. Yung coverage niya. Nasa light to medium lang. Kasi nakikita ko pa yung mga veins ko dito. Yung mga freckles ko. Still visible. Pero nai-even out niya yung skin tone. Make sure na everything is well blended out. So, tapos na tayo maglagay ng BB cream. Talagang light lang, light to medium lang ang coverage niya. Kasi nakikita ko pa yung mga veins sa face ko. Tapos, um, hindi siya matte finish, dewy. Dewy finish siya. Hindi naman siya sticky, pero dahan-dahan lang kayo sa paglagay para hindi maging overly white yung face niyo at saka para hindi maging masyadong sticky. Okay, next na gagamitin natin ay si EB Advance um, Concealer na bura na yung uh, masulat sa kanya. But this costs only 100 pesos. Tapos, i-blend out lang natin using our fingertips. Medyo sticky siya sa pakiramdam. Pero, nagbibigay siya ng coverage. I just hope that this will not settle 
sa fine lines ko under my eyes. So, meron ako na fine lines dito. Let's see kung magiging okay ba ang performance nito throughout the day. Next na gagamitin natin is si Nichido Final Powder. Favorite ni Anne Clutes ito. This costs, if I'm not mistaken, uh, nabili ko to dati ng 150 pesos. Pero hindi ko sure kung same pa rin yung presyo kasi medyo matagal na yun. Okay. So, maglagay tayo ng product dito sa takip. Tapos, i-dip natin yung brush sa product. And we are now going to bake our face kasi oily skin tayo. Lalo na sa T-zone. Pero yung napapansin ko lately nung uh, palamig na yung panahon, nagiging dry yung outer areas of my face. I mean, oo, yung dito. Part dito. Lagay tayo sa areas na mandali tayo mag oil up. So, next na gagawin natin is yung eyebrows natin. Today, we'll, we will use the Chris Aquino brow, brow Liner and Brow Mascara. So, two-in-one siya. Ganito yung sure ng packaging niya. It costs 275 pesos. Ito yung sure niya pala. Ayan. Sa isang end, nandito yung product. Triangular shape siya. Naswatch ko na to dati. Parang medyo light siya for, for the color of my hair. Tapos dito sa kabila, yung eyebrow mascara. Ayan. Okay. Maganda siya kasi maliit lang yung wand. So before anything else, we have to brush our eyebrows. Para mawala na rin yung ibang setting powder na napunta sa eyebrows natin. Eyebrows. So, please give me ample time for this. This will be the first time I'll be using this product. At saka, hindi talaga ako mahilig sa eyebrow liner. Talaga, mas hilig ko talaga yung, um, what you call this? The eyebrow pomming. At saka, brush. Okay, so, start na tayo by outlining our eyebrow. Okay, now let's go to our next kilay. Pigmented siya. Konting, ano, bag masyado madiin kasi talagang pigmented siya. So, pag medyo nadiinan mo, talagang labas agad yung, ano, intense na yung kulay. Okay, so this is how my eyebrows look like right now after using the Chris Aquino eyebrow liner. Um, I think medyo um, it's too light for the hair for the color of my hair. Tsaka parang may, may reddish undertone siya. So hindi ko masyadong gusto ang tone niya. Mali siguro yung shade na nakuha ko. Okay, next na gagamitin natin I see Everpilena All Day Eyeliner Pen. Ayan siya. And this costs only 190 pesos. So, felt tip siya. Ayan. Felt tip. Swatch natin. Very black. Ayan. Intense yung kulay niya. Tsaka, medyo semi-gloss yung finish. Start. Medyo, ano, um, it's always a struggle for me to apply eyeliner, so please bear with me. Fast forward na lang natin to. Napansin ko, intense yung color niya dito sa swatch, pero pag inapply mo sa eyelid, somehow parang nawawala yung intensity ng color niya. Ayan, medyo mahirap siyang i-apply dun sa pinaka outer ano, edge. It's not easy to use for um, doing a cut eyeliner. Okay. 
Okay, now we are finished with our eyeliner. Next step is to remove the excess powder. Mamaya, is a set natin to with a uh, mist para mawala yung powdery look. Next step is to apply mascara. I bought the Nichido eyelash curler. Ito ano din to? Favorite din ni, Ma, ni Mama Ann Clutes. This costs only 188 pesos. So let's start curling our lashes. I always count up to 20 para mas okay yung curl ng lashes. Maganda siya, nakaka curl siya ng lashes talaga. Kaya pala ano? Gusto gusto ni Mama Mama Ann Clutes to eh. Ang mascara na gagamitin natin ay si Fashion 21. Fashion 21 Double Up Mascara. At ang presyo niya ay 239. Ganito ang itsura niya. Tapos, ganito yung wand niya. Para siyang plastic wand. Nagamit ko na siya dati. Okay siya. Pero, hindi siya, ano, hindi siya waterproof. Mabilis kasi ako magpawis. Kaya, most of the time, ang pinipili ko, yung waterproof na mascara. Pero maganda siya. Nakaka, ano siya, nakakabigay ng volume sa lashes. At saka, nakaka-lente ng lashes. Can you see the difference? This one is with mascara. This one without. Okay, so curl natin yung kabilang eyelashes. So, I always, after putting mascara and before putting mascara sa lower lashes ko, I always put um, brow, uh, brown powder, dark brown powder dito sa my outer, outer core, hindi na makapagsalita si Mami Katya. <laughs> outer corner of my eyes. So, ang gagamitin natin today for that and also for the contour later is the EB Advance Contour. Contour Shade and Light Palette. This is how it looks like. It reminds me of the packaging packaging of the Urban Decay Naked Palette. And it has three powders and three contour shades. So we are going to use the darkest one. By the way, this costs only 395 pesos. <clears throat> so, kuha tayo ng brush para sa paglagay ng outer powder sa outer corner. Ay, swatch natin. Pigmented siya. Tsaka, wala siyang ano, wala siyang orange or red undertone, which I like. Kasi gusto ko talaga yung parang cool toned contour lang. Gagawin natin to para magmukhang deep set yung eyes natin. Ma kumbaga magkaroon ng definition yung mga mata natin okay, tapos gagamit tayo na highlighter para sa inner corners of the eyes, just to give some sparkle to the eyes we are going to use the EB Advanced uh, Glow Out Highlighter this costs 199 pesos only, and we will use the shade Candlelight so, ito medyo, may, uh, hindi medyo, talagang gold yung shade niya. Swatch natin sa kamay. Maganda siya. Gold talaga yung tone niya. So, I'd rather use it talaga sa mata. Kasi hindi bagay sa akin yung gold dito. At saka, like what I said in my everyday makeup tutorial, talagang hindi ako masyado mahilig sa highlighters. Kasi nakikita yung texture ng skin ko. Pero, maybe I just haven't found the right highlighter yet. Okay, so, lagay na tayo dito. 
Oh, pero maganda to pang ano, oh. Pang inner ko, in, ano, pang lagay sa inner corner ng mata. Talagang ano, it gives you that oomph, that extra oomph. Kahit simple lang, medyo at least may konting spark. Next na gagawin natin is to contour our face para magkaroon naman ng dimension at hindi flat ang face natin. We will use the same shade that we used for the outer corner of the eyes. Tap out the excess product. And then, I always start here. Or what you can do so that you will know where to put the contour powder is to do this face, the duck face. <laughs> so, kung saan yun yung, yung lubog na part, doon yung ilalagay yung contour powder, okay? And then, always blend upwards. Konti-konti lang ha, kasi... Ito nga, alam nyo, konti lang ang nilagay ko, pero very pigmented siya. Bongga. Okay, always blend upwards. Yan, kita niyo yung difference? Blend lang natin. Same goes with the other cheek. Konti lang talaga ang kailangan yung product kasi very pigmented talaga siya. Okay, I like it. Yung excess, lagay natin dito sa noo. Para mabawasan naman ang paradahan ng mga aeroplano. <laughs> Then, we are going to use the same shade again for the jawline. Para mas defined yung jaw natin. Maganda siya. I like it. Ang next na gagamitin natin ay ang Vice Phenomenal Velvet Liquid Lip Kit. It's this one. In the shade, Iskerabu. Iskerabu. Anong ibig sabihin nun, Iskerebu? If you guys know what it means, please comment down below. Kasi talagang, I don't know what it means. Tsaka ang gaganda ng ano, no? Ang gaganda ng mga names ng mga products ni Vice. Talagang very, ano, kakaiba, very unique. So, it comes with a lip liner. Ganyan siya. Hindi na siya kailangan i-sharpen. And it also comes with the liquid, velvet liquid lipstick. Oh, by the way, it costs only 295 pesos. So let's start with outlining our lips. Ah, ito may sticker siya to indicate the color. Pero parang, parang mas light yung sticker kaysa sa product itself. Okay yung lip liner, hindi siya mahirap i-apply. Kasi di ba yung iba, ano, yung iba, um, medyo dry. Now, we will use the Velvet Liquid Lipstick. Mm. I really love this shade. Nakaka, ano siya, nakaka fresh lang. Very pigmented siya. You don't need to have a lot of swipes for the color to show. Maganda yung shade niya. Hindi siya kumakapit sa dry patches ng aking lips. One swipe, you get the color that you see. Okay, ano next na gagawin natin? We will use the blush. Ang gagamitin natin blush ay yung nude blush from Shawel. Ayan. This nude blush costs 160 pesos lang. Ay, 168 pesos. Sorry. It's in the variant 2. And it comes in this container and it has three shades of blushes. It also comes with a blush brush. Pero hindi natin gagamitin ang blush brush nila. Gagamitin natin ang sarili natin blush brush. Okay. So I will use the shade in the middle. Ito. Kasi yung lipstick color natin is medyo peachy. So we will use the blush that is also peachy. Magda drunk blush ulit tayo. So we will start the middle of the nose. Here. 
going outwards. Konting ano lang oh, konting dip lang sa product. Very pigmented na siya. Can you see that? Oh? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mukha na ba tayong ano? Tipsy? <laughs> Ay, nakalimutan natin maglagay ng mascara sa lower lashes. It's always a struggle for me to apply mascara sa lower lashes. Kasi once na nalagyan na ng mascara yung skin, nako. Sayang ang ano, masisira ang makeup, masisira yung base. Kaya dahan-dahan lang tayo sa paglagay ng mascara sa lower lashes. Next, we will use the Evian Natural Mineral Water Facial Spray. This is the big uh, variety. Merong mas maliit nito eh. This has 150 ml and it costs only 349 pesos. Medyo may kamahalan siya pero matagal mo naman magagamit to kasi konti-konti lang naman yung, yung kailangan mag spray sa face. Okay, let's spray. Fresh. Spraying with a facial mist will help your makeup um, to blend in with the skin, to melt into your skin, and it will also freshen up the look. At saka, aalis na yung pagka-powder ng makeup niyo. Okay guys, so this is the finished look using all the budget-friendly makeup products that I use today. Let's go through them quickly one by one. Yung Sunblock na Quick FX, okay siya. Hindi siya malagkit sa skin, so pasok siya sa akin. Yung Everbillay na BB Cream na whitening, um, it's okay, it's alright. Pero yung, yung tone niya kasi is a little too white for my skin tone. And it's also um, sticky ng konti. Pero I would use it again. It's an okay product. The next product that I used was the concealer. I didn't like the concealer. Because um, parang masyado siyang... Parang na-emphasize na yung yung lines under my eyes at saka hindi basta para naging dry yung under eyes ko at saka para masyadong maputi then next si Nichido syempre all time favorite ko yan pasok na pasok yan sa akin um, ang susunod ay uh, Chris Aquino eyebrow, eyebrow liner and mascara Okay siya, pero maganda, very pigmented, pero ma I think mali yung shade na nakuha ko kasi it's too light for the for my hair. Next, pero okay siya sa akin. Next is the Everbilena All Day Eyeliner Pen. Maganda siya sa swatch, pero unfortunately, hindi siya maganda sa eyelids. Nung ginamit ko siya sa eyelids, hindi lumabas yung intensity ng color niya. So, at saka mabilis siya mawala. Yung ibang parts dito ng eyeliner ko medyo nag-fade na. And to think na kanina ko lang in-apply yun. So, I definitely don't recommend this to you guys. Next product that I use is the Fashion... Fashion? <laughs> the Fashion 21 Double Up Mascara. Maganda siya because it gives you uh, it gives your eyelashes length and it volumizes them also. Ang downside lang nito, hindi siya waterproof. Kung hindi mo naman kailangan ng waterproof mascara, this will do. Next is the EB Advance Shade and Light Palette. Maganda to. Sulit ah 395 pesos niyo dito kasi 3 shades na and 3 powders makukuha niyo. Very pigmented, konting ano lang um okay na yung pigmentation niya. So, pasok to sa akin. Uh, the, next, the, the next product I use is the Vice Phenomenal Velvet Liquid Lip Kit. Okay siya sa akin. Maganda yung color niya. Easy application. Very pigmented. One swipe. You don't need a lot of swipes for it for you to get the color. So, okay siya. Um, pasok din siya sa akin. So, the next product that I used was the Shawil Mood Blush. Ito maganda to. For only 168 pesos, you get 3 shades for of blushes. And only a little product on your brush is enough to for, for the whole face. So, very pigmented. Pigmented siya. Pasok din siya sa akin. Yung eyelash curler na Nichido, na favorito din ni, mama, ni Mami Anclots. 
okay siya. Pasok siya sa akin. Very easy to curl the lashes. And the Evian facial spray is also okay. For 349 pesos, you get a bit big bottle and you will use this for a long time. It also does the job in removing the powdery finish and it helps uh, your makeup to melt into the skin for a more natural look. Oh, I forgot to mention the EB Advanced Glow Out Highlighter in Candlelight. Okay siya for the inner corner of my eyes but I don't think that it will be okay for this area of my face because it's a malalaki yung glitters niya, so I think it will emphasize the texture of my skin. Okay, so that's all guys. If you like this video, please don't forget to like the video. Comment down below. Please comment down below yung mga makeup products na budget-friendly na favorite niyo. So you can share it also with me and with our viewers. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel. So this is Mami Kat, now signing off. Till my next video.